Hey everybody, it's Mark with G's Bees, and I'm up here at the world headquarters of G's Bees. And uh, I guess G's Bees also includes bumblebees. I guess. There she is. Anyway, um, decided to put a garden up in the uh, in the bee yard. I figured I had uh, had electric fence, so I put a garden up there. Had some tomatoes, cucumbers, zucchinis. Uh, peppers didn't do very well, but anyway. So, as y'all can see, there are no bees in these boxes. This has been the worst year ever. Uh, I started out with 34 hives. I think I'm down to 20 or 21. All these boxes are empty. So, I took the time now to rebuild some stands. Um, I kind of got a solar wax melter there, but not really. It was a different project. Uh, it was the, the steam uh, frame uh, wax melter but anyway I just put a piece of glass on I got some old comb and foundation stuff like that but anyway so I've taken the time to rebuild stuff square things away um, get everything ready I guess for the springtime uh, I've been fighting when I first started this I had these stumps in the way so I think I'm gonna move the fence in one notch and not be over top of those I kind of hate to lose the space but I believe I've left enough space here where I could add another row facing the other direction. So, uh, really disappointing year. Um, but I understand there's there's a lot of uh, beekeepers that have had the same same troubles this year. Uh, just no honey. I'm really having to start to feed uh, feed the bees, um, and it gets to be expensive. So, but anyway, just want to give you all an update. At least we got bumblebees.